strong earthquake swarm in Katla Volcano, June 30th, 2023. During the night of the 30th of June, 2023, an earthquake swarm began at Katla Volcano with an initial large quake with a magnitude of 3.3. Now, this update is 24 hours later when the largest earthquake in the swarm overnight was magnitude 4.4, and there were a total of eight earthquakes with a magnitude of above M3.0 in the earthquake swarm with a total of 58 earthquakes total. This is according to Icelandic Met Office website. This earthquake activity is ongoing even if currently there are no earthquakes taking place at the writing of the article. This earthquake activity is was clearly felt in Porsmork area and was resulting in people losing sleep because Katla is a big explosive rhyolitic volcano. According to news reports, in Iceland, there has now been an increase in conductivity in the Mulskavsil Glacier River. It seems to be directly connected to the earthquake swarm activity that took place during the night. There's also more water in the Mulskavsil Glacier River. If that is connected, it's unclear because of rain in Iceland in recent days. Now, this... Volcano, Katla, is underneath of a large glacier, and often when it erupts, huge outwash floods occur called joculips. And let's get more on the geologic summary of Katla Volcano. Located near the southern end of Iceland's eastern volcanic zone, it's hidden beneath the Mjödjökull ice cap. The subglacial basaltic to rhyolitic volcano is one of Iceland's most active and is a frequent producer of damaging joculips, or glacial outburst floods. A large 10 by 14 kilometer subglacial caldera, along with a long axis in northwest southeast direction, is up to 750 meters deep. Its highest point reaches 1,380 meters, and three major outlet glaciers have reached its rim. The volcano is located within the Katla and UNESCO Global Geopark property. The eruptive history is VEI 4, 3, 4, and 5, with the last two confirmed eruptions at VEI 4 and the most recent confirmed eruption in 1918, uh, previous to that in 1860. So long overdue for a large eruption. And this activity uh, began back in May when an earthquake swarm triggered the alert status to be raised in fear of a potential eruption. A similar earthquake swarm to the one we're seeing now raised the alert level back in May and similar magnitude earthquakes. This one only 29 tremors in 48 hours. The one we're currently experiencing at Katla is, has quite a, a bit more, maybe 50 or 60, and the activity has waned off, but that doesn't mean that the earthquake swarm is over. So keeping a close, close eye on Katla for you and everyone else, a volcano that can erupt in spectacular fashion. And that's a boom to knowledge. Hit that subscribe button, share this video, and be safe, especially if you're in Iceland.